Investigators hope data on the plane's black boxes will help explain what caused the Russian passenger jet to suddenly plunge from the sky with 224 people on board. 20 minutes after takeoff from Egypt Saturday morning, the Airbus 321 reached a cruising altitude of about 33,500 feet, then almost immediately plummeted at 67 miles per hour, disappearing from radar with no distress call from the pilots. As the victims' bodies are recovered and flown to Russia, airline officials quickly seem to rule out human error and technical problems with the plane. The airlines are blaming anything except them. So when they talk about outside influences, it could be either a technical problem not caused by them, by the manufacturer, or in the case, I think what they're implying here is terror. But Russian investigators say it's too early to make any conclusions. Former head of the NTSB, Peter Goles, agrees. We have the company speaking, I think, out of line, saying that their aircraft was in perfect condition and there was no problems. Then you have the Egyptians who are saying, well, it, it broke up at flight, but there's absolutely no sign of terrorism. I think that all of those statements are inappropriate and uh, ill-timed. ISIS is active in this part of the Sinai Peninsula, and the group has claimed responsibility. It's unlikely, but I wouldn't rule it out. But based on initial reading of radar, satellite information, and photos from the crash site, U.S. intelligence sources say there is, so far, no evidence of terrorism or the plane being hit by something like a missile. Investigators continue to search the massive crash debris field for evidence. They will also explore whether an accident 14 years ago involving this exact aircraft played a role. The tail hit the runway during landing, causing substantial damage. It was repaired and has since flown hundreds of flights. The airline adds that the aircraft passed a full inspection in May. You want to see whether that repair was done right and whether the maintenance over the years was done correctly.